Hey guys, welcome back to The Tried Truth. Today I'm gonna review a fragrance from 2015 by Sean John. It is 3 a.m. Stay tuned. Okay guys, we're back. So 3 a.m. by Sean John is an aromatic spicy fragrance, as I said, from 2015. And uh, the accords of the fragrance are citrus, aromatic, green, fresh, spicy, leather, white floral, fresh, warm, spicy, aromatic, and sweet. And uh, we'll just go right on into the notes here. Um, so in the top, you get um, the fragrance opens up with bergamot, mandarin orange, and cardamom. And then in the mid, you get fig leaf, orange blossom, geranium, tonic water, and leather. When I first got this fragrance, I've had it, uh, well, I bought it four years ago, I would say, three, four years ago. Um, after a little encounter with it, I gave it to my son along with a bunch of other fragrances. He, he, has, um, he has quite a collection. But uh, anyway, my nose has changed. I don't know if any of you have experienced that. Um, but the other day, I got my nose on this thing, and I was really impressed with it. Um, you know, it's good sprayer, too, by the way. Look at this. Yeah, that's nice. Right when you spray the fragrance, you definitely get that bergamot. You get that mandarin orange, for sure. Um, the, the cap only goes on one way. So you, it's almost like a little jigsaw puzzle. So if you try to put it on backwards, it will not go. And um, so there's that. So you let me double check here. Oh, I had it backwards to begin with. Okay. So it does snap into place. And the only place on this... It does say Sean John on the the uh, atomizer there, the base of the atomizer, but the only place it says 3 a.m. is right here on that sticker. So it does remind me of Boss Orange Man, um, the window uh, kind of pane bottle. This is one of the best cheapies on the market today. It's uh, it's still available. You can still get it. Right now, you can get it at the perfumespot.com for $17.55. Some fragrances, the quality is still very good. There's uniqueness, uh, the combination of the notes, the blend. And this is one of them. You really get this opening of bergamot, mandarin origin, and the cardamom just really gives it a soft spiciness. In the mid, you got the fig leaf, the orange blossom, and geranium. So you do get a nice... Uh, you get a spicy, sweet, citrusy, kind of a little bit floral, but not a lot of floral in this. And then in the base, you have the tonic water and the leather. So it does have a slightly boozy side effect to it. I'm sad I gave this away so soon. I didn't give it a chance. Um, it's a sneaky fragrance. It's not one that when you apply this fragrance, you know, it's going to be a room filler or anything like that. It's kind of a sleeper fragrance. It's there when you don't even think it is. And um, it has a really unique sillage. It will sneak up on you and you'll forget you're wearing it. And then all of a sudden you'll catch whiffs of it. Uh, you may walk into a room and then, you know, you'll stop, stand there for a second. And before you know it, you're smelling it. Something about the scent trail. It kind of just follows behind you. And then when you stop, bam, it just... It keeps coming. Really sweet, citrusy. Um, and the tonic water, you know, it is slight, but it's noticeable. And um, leather is not a note in this that I don't, I just don't feel like it needs to even be stated. Overall, it's, it's a wonderful fragrance. I'm telling you, I'm really enjoying it. So as far as value for the price, yeah, this is a stunner for $17.55. Uh, it's a 100 milliliter bottle. Um, it's sweet, it's intoxicating type of scent. It's it's very attractive. Um, as far as an age group, anybody can wear this. I could see a teenager wearing it or uh, a, a guy in his 50s. I mean, um, it may be unisex, but I'd say this is a masculine scent. I love the atomizer. It's one of the best atomizers in the game. Look at that. Impressive sprayer, I agree with that. Unique and well done mix of notes, absolutely. I don't have... Uh, a lot like this. The fact that it's still available since 2015 is a good thing. Most people are going to like this one. Um, fresh and versatile scent. Yeah, I'd say it's an anytime, any, 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 anywhere you can wear this. Um, attractive bottle design. I don't care about that much, but it's not ugly. Um, let's see. Beautifully masculine. Well, 
So uh, it's, it is a compliment magnet. This is definitely a compliment beast right here. Um, unisex, yeah, I'd still go with that. You put this on um, before you go out, you know, let's say you're, you're going out for drinks or a movie, you put this on, it's gonna hang pretty much till 3 a.m. Even though the projection may dissipate a little bit, you're still gonna catch whiffs of this. It's, it's, it's still gonna be heat activated. It's still going to respond to humidity. Um, perspiration, things like that are really going to push this scent. And it's going to also, it's going to mingle kind of with your own skin chemistry. So you're going to, you're going to get a real unique scent vibe from this one. Since 2015, I truly believe that it didn't get the hype or the love that it should have. Overall, like I said, it's got a real nice, warm, sweet, citrusy, cardamom, spicy. Um, and then with that booziness of that tonic water. I really like it. It almost has a gin and tonic type of vibe to it. I think it would really be appealing to the ladies. Like if that's your thing, if, if you're trying to find a scent that's sexy, um, going to get you some attention, this is going to do it for you. Trust me there. Um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm certain. In fact, I'm convinced that uh, this would probably be one of those lady killer type of fragrances. Even though it's a subtle it's not a room filler it's not a projection beast or anything like that what it does offer is very attractive scent it's a very unique attractive profile there's nothing else like this out there there's not no one else is wearing it either um i mean trust me on that i mean it's from 2015 but it still smells modern it doesn't smell dated it doesn't smell old i just think it just you know, from 2015 till now, there's been a lot of good stuff and, you know, stuff that comes out and just kind of pushes things out of the way. They get set off to the side and forgotten about quickly. But this is definitely a unique fragrance. Still smells modern. Still smells relevant. Very, very good. Yeah, very, very good. Office friendly. Um, any event, any occasion, any time of year, even though I think warmer weather would be better for this one um i think it still has with that cardamom i still think it has enough of a spiciness to to last in colder weather as well a good solid four hours of just enjoying this fragrance but i do believe even after that you're still going to catch whiffs of it i'd overspray with this one i would definitely I, I wouldn't worry about it for the price i mean i'd go 10 sprays or better uh, i'd make sure i got it on my clothes a little bit if you really want to get some better performance out of it, you shouldn't have any problem getting a good six hours out of it. Um, but yeah, I'm totally enjoying it. I'm so glad I got it back from my son. He said he never wore it. So you can see it's still a full bottle and I'm glad I have it. Like I said, I don't know if it's discontinued or not. It probably is, but uh, that doesn't mean you can't get it. It's still available out there. I see, like I said, Perfume Spot has it. All right, guys, thanks for stopping into the Tried Truth. I hope to see you next time.